So I've been toying around with the idea of uh, cheap ways to accent my collection. And uh, I've already made a few of these, but I thought it'd be cool to do a quick tutorial on how I'm uh, making some really cheap uh, accents for my display. Uh, so you can see here we have a uh, Asian market, uh, I believe it's Japanese poster for Revenge of the Sith. And uh, these are uh, poster size, and I've downloaded it to my computer. And what I can do is uh, go to my printer settings and select a four by six glossy photo paper, and I can print this. Uh, you can shrink to fit or fit page. In this case, I'm going to do fit page, and a uh, fill page, excuse me. And when I got my printer ink, they were nice enough to include. Uh, a stack of four by six blank uh, photo sheets, uh, which I think is pretty clever because um, now I want to print a bunch of pictures, which means I'll have to buy more ink. So good on them for that. Um, but we're going to print this and then we'll see the quality. We're also going to print a few other Star Wars posters that are available online. And uh, of course, this is copywritten material, so I wouldn't uh, particularly go about selling these. Uh, but yeah, so we're going to print this and a few others and then we'll see how they look. Okay, so I printed uh, three of these, and uh, they all came out pretty decent. I wouldn't say uh, that this one is particularly amazing, but the resolution was pretty low compared to these two. These two look really crisp. Uh, I'm too lazy to edit this on like Photoshop and Illustrator. I have those programs, but it's not going to bother me that much, this little white strip. Um, so we're, we have the prints, and uh, we're going to basically... Uh, put them in an L-shaped frame. Uh, so I'll show you what that's going to look like. Here. Okay, so we have the acrylic here and we have our photo here. And uh, this is essentially just a bent frame. And we're gonna slot the picture into there and put it in the collection. And uh, that's really easy to do. Now, when you get these from, uh, I get these at Walmart there. Uh, I think they're like 97 cents for one frame. And uh, they come with a plastic film that's on the acrylic. So when you go there, don't worry if the one that you pick out looks a little scratched. It's more than likely just the uh, protective film. And you'll peel that off and you have your glossy acrylic photo that's going to be framed. And then we're gonna put that in our display like that. And this is a little Revenge of the Sith shelf. I have a Return of the Jedi here. Uh, the Solo and the Rogue One are in progress. And then over here I have a Jaws, a Jurassic Park, Big Hero 6, and a Halo 3 ODST uh, poster. So very cool. These are about, uh, you know, if you get the prints at Walmart, if they let you get the prints at Walmart, they're 27 cents, I think. So for about less than $1.50, you can add uh, one of these to your collection. And, you know, with four cubes, that's uh, $6, $12 for eight cubes worth. Like I said, I need to go back and get some more frames. But these are very cool, very cheap ways to accent your collection. And I think they look pretty damn good on display.